So we know that in covalent bonds, two atoms share a pair of electrons. Well, there's a slight plot twist because there's actually two types of covalent bonds, nonpolar covalent bonds and polar covalent bonds. What does it mean to be polar? Where have we seen this word before? Did you think of a polar bear? It's okay if you did because you'd actually be right. Polar bears come from the Arctic Circle, which surrounds the North Pole. The Earth has both a North Pole and a South Pole, terms that actually derive from the poles of a magnet. A magnetic pole is a region at each end of a magnet where the external magnetic field is the strongest. Like poles repel each other, and unlike poles attract each other. So can we say that the Earth acts as an enormous magnet? Yes, actually. The North and South Poles have positive and negative polarity, which actually flip over time. The last geomagnetic reversal was 780,000 years ago. And this polarity of the Earth is the driving force behind the magnetic compass, whose needle always points north.